<laughs> oh, it's perfect. Oh, Thank happy you. Happy anniversary. <laughs> All right. Now your turn. Oh. <laughs> Aww. What do you think? Um, you got me a piece of paper with the word Detroit written on it? Oh, no, 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 no. I got you Detroit, the city. It's just, it's just too big to fit in the box, even though they lost 25% of their population. No, no, wait, wait, wait. What do you mean you got me Detroit? I bought you the city. How is that possible? Well, there was a bankruptcy auction, and I didn't expect to win, but I was the only bidder. And I was thinking, oh, she's not going to be expecting this. Uh, Fred, what am I supposed to do with Detroit? Well, you don't like it? Uh, no, I mean, that's... <laughs> it's Detroit. Uh, what were you thinking? You always return all the clothes I buy you. I just... That doesn't mean that you buy me Detroit. I tell you what. Let's go watch the Clint Eastwood Super Bowl ad about Detroit, and, and you'll get all pumped up. No! I don't want to watch a Clint Eastwood Super Bowl ad. Fun. Who the hell are you? I come with Detroit. Homeless. Are you gonna make dinner soon? I want steakums. No, who is on the phone? Some union guy. The union guy's been calling for you. They're very upset about you cutting their pensions. Oh no, oh no, 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 nope. Uh, I cannot own Detroit. I don't know anything about it. <sighs> Could you take a message? <laughs> <sighs> Honey, I will help you run Detroit. You can't do any worse than the people they've been electing for 50 years. You don't know anything about Detroit either. Cars. <laughs> Fred, I need to own Detroit like I need a hole in the head. And that's a perfect place to get one. Oh. Sweetie, okay, look, it's our anniversary. Let's go out to dinner, have some drinks, and we'll talk about it. I don't want Detroit. Sweetie, it's one of the greatest American cities of all time. Yeah, sure, but I... Honey. People are out of work, and they're all wondering what they're going to do to get back on their feet. And we're all scared, because this isn't a game. The people of Detroit know a little something about that. You're just quoting the Clint Eastwood ad right now, aren't you? I don't know anything about Detroit. The mayor's on the phone. He says all of Detroit's on fire. What should he do? Nothing! Uh, the, the usual. 